Hi guys, how you doing? This is me, Stradicovasan, with another video for you guys today. So in this video, we are reviewing Koska Reeves from Star Wars: The Mandalorian. Uh, yeah, just got this in the post literally today, so very, very happy to have this finally in the collection. I've been seeing lots of other people getting it, and I was very, very jealous. <laughs> but here we are. She is here, so here is the review. Just before we go get started, please go ahead and like the video, comment and subscribe. We are over 300 subscribers now, so a massive round of applause to you guys. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, I really appreciate that support and I will be doing a giveaway. Uh, I'm not sure where, maybe next week, maybe this week, next week for that 300 subscribers. It will be on a uh, live stream, so stay tuned for that. I'll let you know in advance. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get back to Costco Reeves. Uh, as I said, just came in the post from In Demand Toys. Uh, this was some import stock that they had. So, uh, yeah, very happy to have this. We'll have a look at the card back first. So, uh, there she is right here. I don't think it's from, that image is from the, uh, Mandalorian TV show. It's more like a artist, um, impression sort of thing. So, that's fine. And name peel here, Koska V with the blue background and the blue behind the figure looking really nice. Um, yeah, maybe I don't, I would have preferred a better card back, but that's okay, it's not bad, is it? Let's flip it over. As you can see, you've got the import sticker here from Hong Kong. This is VC230 in the collection. And then here are the other figures in um, the, this wave and the wave before. So, we've reviewed the Mithril, Quill, Bib Fortuna, Lobot, Migs Mayfield, Bo-Katan. They're all reviewed on the channel in the Vintage Collection playlist. Uh, I don't have Axe Woves yet, but uh, I'm doing Costco reviews right now. So, yeah, looking forward to it. So, that's all we can really say about the um, car back and the, um, yeah, whatever else. So, let's get it open. <laughs> There we go, a clean, well, a clean, <laughs> yeah. This is the thickest card stock, by the way, so it is, um, yeah, it is a nice card. Here we go. So here she is, Koska Reeve, Sasha Banks, however you know her, there she is in the vintage collection. We're looking really, really nice. I'll just get her and her, um, Accessories out, and then we'll have a little deeper look. Wait for it, the last gun, there we are. Right. Oh, let's chuck this away for recycling. <laughs> All right, so let's have a look at the figure first. So, first of all, look at that face sculpt. Really, really, really nice. Loving the hair piece. All that detail I go went into that. Looks really, really good. She looks quite angry from there, doesn't she? Ooh. <laughs> and then, yeah, her armour here. Nicely weathered, which is really, really good. See, like, the scratches on there and stuff. Got her belt buckle. Got those, uh, uh, ball, ball hip joints, which is nice. I'll go through all the articulation in a moment. This is a little part for her jetpack here. The holster for her pistol. Right, so let's talk a little bit about articulation, shall we? So the f head goes f uh, forward and backwards like that, hindered a little bit by this piece of, um, uh, what is it, her uh, hair. <laughs> uh, it does go all the way around like so. Look at that face, I really like that sculpt. It's very little, um, imperfections, really, really nice. Look at even the ears. <laughs> um, arms do lift up and rotate, hindered by this, but it does lift up if you want to 
uh, swivel completely around, but you don't really need to. <laughs> don't know why you need to do that. Um, there is a joint on the elbow, like so. It does rotate, like so. And the hands do rotate as well, which is nice. Uh, there is a up crunch and it does turn all the way around and as I said before the hips are on a ball joint Good good. Uh, there is a hinge at the knee ball joint on the uh, feet and if you so wish to put it on the stand there are peg holes So really really nice figure um, Accessories it does come with a removable helmet, so I'll do that for you now. There you go, guys. So that looks really, really nice there. Have a good little mando. I think I'll probably get another one of these, so then I can display her with the helmet on and off. Um, it does also come with only one blaster. Uh, I think bo -Katan came with two, didn't she? But this one does only come with one, so I'll pop that in our holster straight away, otherwise I will lose it. Oh. Very flimsy, you can just see that. Yeah, there it is, looking nice. And also a jetpack, which is here. That's looking nice as well, isn't it? Very clean. Um, I don't really mind that not being weathered so much. I mean, it's a little bit, but yeah, it looks good to me. So I'll pop that on her back, like so. There we go. What do you guys think? Very similar scope to, oh, one second, Vane's Finder. It does come down, which is nice. <laughs> Um, very similar sculpt to Bo-Katan Crease, which is on the channel as a review, so yeah, pretty much the same sculpt, but I really, really like this figure. I will take the helmet off because I do like the Koska Reeves uh, face sculpt. There we go. There we go guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comments what you think of this figure. I think she looks really, really, really nice. I'm really glad I have her in my collection finally. She's one of my favorite characters uh, from The Mandalorian. And I hope to see her again soon in season three. And always love more Mandalorians in the line. So yeah, let me know what you think in the comments and remember to stay tuned for the live stream with the giveaway, the details there and we can have a giveaway for 300 subscribers. Thank you so much for watching. This is me, Strider Coversong. Take care, see you soon, bye.